What is up guys, Rhythm Rider back again with another epic adventure. Today guys, I got something awesome for you. This is an abandoned country estate. I was out driving with Zen Jose, she's right there. Randomly came across this gorgeous, gorgeous house. But anyways guys, let's check it out. Alright guys, we are in this massive abandoned country estate that, as I said in the intro, Sending with Zay and I just randomly came across. Right now, we are in an enclosed porch, and right off the bat, you can tell there was some major money in this place, because look at, nice wood ceiling, and this is a big porch, you know, big enclosed porch. And look at this, water's getting in here. You got all this green, like moldy nastiness, but pretty sweet spot. And huge, huge sprawling property. But it stinks in here and it smells like wet dog kind of thing. I feel like they had dogs. The last people that lived here either had dogs and just didn't clean up. Cause like, look at it, it's disgusting along here. And there is a dog food bag right there, but they could have even been using this just to let the dogs live in on their own or something. Kind of weird, but huge, huge room. I kind of feel this would be like the living or sorry, dining room. Big central kind of room to, uh, in the whole house. And over here, we got a bathroom. Shower. But so far, it probably doesn't look like much. But I assure you, it's an incredible place. And like the flooring is, is terrible. But look at, like you can see filth all along. I guarantee there was dogs living in here, un, you know, like unsupervised. Got a bedroom. And again, just filthy. Now, this is weird. We'll cut in the door. Look at this cabinet. It's pretty fancy. Oh, is that a mirror? No, it's painted. Oh, it's not a mirror. It's actually spray painted black. And look at this. This door's cut in half too. I'm wondering if they were keeping, this was used as kennels so they could keep the door, you know, closed but still see what's going on. And same with that other room. This is probably a puppy mill actually, now that I start thinking about it. Let's see what the back of this looks like. Yeah, it's just filthy. I, get, I guarantee this was a puppy mill. And look at this archway. That's pretty sweet. But like, what's the deal with this spray painting and stuff? Got a kitchen back here. I guess it would be the main kitchen of the house. Oh, and so many spider webs. I don't know if you guys can see that on camera, but they're thick. But nice size kitchen. And look at this rusty old lamp like that is so rusted and of course you got to check out those beams all hand cut and kind of finished they're beautiful and it's nice that they kind of go down on the slope there someone put some a lot of work into making this place a nice place and only to have it you know destroyed by whoever last lived here like this is the filth Looks like this is the laundry room back here. Yeah, and look at the walls. Bathroom. Oh, and a shower. And a tub. What is up, guys? 
I'm looking at the bottom of this door. It's been chewed off. But this was the back of the house. Guys, wait till you see the rest of this place. It is so good. Thanks. And like, look at, look at this archway. Gorgeous detail on this stuff. And again, we've got a door also cut and it's filthy at the bottom. Oh, look what I just noticed. Who's that hanging out on the cross there? That's Jesus. So we came in, this is where we started off. We're gonna go check out the rest and this is really nice. Like you've got nice hardwood flooring. Unfortunately, it's just in terrible shape. Look at the size of this room. Beautiful, but all this wood paneling, this is a crime to do this much wood paneling in a house, especially one this beautiful. But look at this room. Those front windows, oh, I just absolutely love it. And of course the paint peel and everything really adds, but like I said, that wood paneling, it should be gone. It's nice to have, you know, these French doors right here. Again, this is probably going to be, you know, a family room, living room. It's a closet with my camera gear, if you're wondering. But look at this. Beautiful staircase. Completely ruined by wood paneling. But regardless, it's still a beauty. Oh, look at this light fixture. Wish I could get a little closer. Let me see if I can shine some light. I'll make it... That's pretty snazzy. And then here's the main entrance. Nice French doors. Once you walk in. And like, got a nice light up or window up there to let light in. Very, very tall ceiling. But you walk in and this will be your first view of the house. Just really nice. But... Not a fan of the wood paneling. And looks like the null post might have had something on top of it. Nice little piece. And this window right here. Love the decay paint peel. I mean, there's still pretty nice stairs. And look at how high that goes. There's some classic detail that you see in a lot of houses. Oh, look at this, it's rounded, I didn't even notice that. Wow, rounded baseboard. And we'll have a little peek down the stairs. Pretty epic. But the stink of dog in here. closet there nice big room parquet pretty dated but look at the windows you got this nice pointed window and then a classic window it's back here oh it's a bathroom Some art left on the wall. This must be a lady. Ugh, toilet's disgusting. Ladies' bathroom because it says hers right there. But look at that bad boy. Leopard print mirror. Perfect for saying, "What is up, guys?" Whoa! Another beauty room but too much wood paneling and even the laminate flooring, it's been waterlogged. So my thinking is, is that when they, the puppies were in here or whatever, they're peeing all over the place, which makes the smell. And that's why this stuff, or the uh, laminate flooring there is coming apart and you know, all water damaged. Nice big windows though. Let's 
nice in here. Just a closet. Oh, it just keeps going on. Got another kitchen area back here, like a kitchenette. And there's some heavy duty wiring going in here, so I bet there was a stove up here. Oh yeah, there's a hood right here. So there would have been a stove down there at one point. And you can see, guys, this place is definitely abandoned. Look at the roof there, but look at the rest of the property. Even a big swimming pool over there. Am I thinking this is probably, you know, a bedroom or something like that? Lots of closet space. Oh, and there would have been a washer and dryer. So this could have been an apartment at one point because there's the electric for a dryer. And there's a, you got your plumbing right there for a washing machine. I feel like this may have been an apartment at one point. Just the bedroom, but classic window. Love those windows. So I am now at the back of the property, guys. I wanted to make sure you could see what's in the barn. There is absolutely nothing. It's all padlocked and very dangerous, but I didn't want you to say, hey, why didn't you go check out those other buildings? So here we are. That building, locked up as well. But I still want to show you the pool. It's pretty awesome because it's, you know, super overgrown and nasty. Alright guys, so here is the swimming pool. Definitely been abandoned this place for quite a long time because you can see how much the water has evaporated plus all the overgrowth of the vines. Let's see if we can get a better angle for you. Oh yeah, we can get up here. Lots of good firewood here. Well, I guess it's all rotten now, but... Here's the back of the place. Then we got the pool, and then we got Zenny with Zay. We'll go check out the backyard. Big piece of uh, asphalt here. I'm wondering if they were some like basketball court or tennis court. Quite possible. Oh, check it out. There's a hot tub. Wow, quite a mess. Wow, there's stuff growing in the hot tub. Oh, look at the original brick building there. That, like stone, sorry. And looking back here, there's those like four by eight sheets of like that particle board. That was put on the fence there for the dogs. So this is definitely a poppy mill at one point. Guys, if I find any information on it, if it was busted or anything, I'll definitely be putting it on my blog, rhythm.rider.com, obviously. Anyways, guys, that's the end of this epic adventure. Wicked abandoned country estate, random discovery, but tell me what you think in the comments down below. If you're not subscribed, definitely subscribe. Smash the like button. Remember guys, always come back, because Rhythm Rider always has that epic shit. All right, thanks for watching. Peace.